Hey guys, Jig and Jerry here. Well, that's right, Mount Pleasant Pier. Uh, looking at the River Watch Cafe, looking down the pier. You know, February had been cold, windy, rainy, rough weather. The fishing was not spectacular. Now, were there fish? Yeah, there were fish here and there. But uh, on days like this, where the uh, water is choppy, and uh, you're over here looking down the bridge and, you know, checking everything out, trying to see if the conditions are just right to catch some fish. You know, uh, spotted sea trout, sheephead has been uh, mostly what we've been concentrating on. And uh, it just has not been that well. The water, as you see here, has been rough. Uh, it has been cold and on this clear day, the wind has been so strong, it's hard to cast and feel your line. But are there fish? Yeah. I would manage to uh, catch some trout, and some others have managed to catch a few trout between 15 inches, 14 inches, and even smaller. Not bad. I've got one here. Now, because the trout have been a little scarce and the even the sheep head have been scarce I haven't been doing much filming with these fish you know I've uh, uh, barely pulled the camera out because like I said it's been slow so I just did this clip here just to show you that there are uh, some small trout and a uh, little 14 and a half 14s and 15s out there sheep head well small ones as well check this one out here all right guys it's probably the darkest sheep head I've ever seen. Check this out. Look at that. He's almost a deep purple. Look at that. Hope oh, he's getting lighter. Right there on the spot. Watch. Oh, camo sheep head. Here comes his stripes. And look at that. Like a deep purple. Isn't that he's supposed to be silver? Ah. You know, one day I'm going to get a big one. <laughs> Now, speaking of big ones, uh, Don uh, managed to find, uh, towards the end of this month, just this, uh, this past week here, uh, a good-sized sheephead. Um, it uh, gave him a decent fight, uh, stayed away from the debris. He was able to land it. Dale here helped him net it while I was filming. Um, this sheephead here turned out to be 8 pounds, 11 ounces, which is a real nice sheephead. We're still looking for our Godzillers out here, and we'll find some eventually, I hope. But uh, it was still a beautiful fish. Uh, Don had put in a lot of time, a lot of days to find this fish. And uh, even myself, I put in a number of days to see if we could find some fish ourselves. And it's been hard to find. Slippery. And there you go. Beautiful fish, Don. Great. That's great to see. Hard to come by. Anyway, why I've been out here at the Mount Pleasant Pier, you know, I realized, you know, the weather, wind, trees blowing, uh, choppy water, uh, sometimes you have to remember it's not just about the fishing. So I decided to bring out one of my other toys. Because remember, the Mount Pleasant Pier is also Memorial Waterfront Park. With a park, what do you do? You play. So I decided to come out and play. Check this out.
Man, this thing is fun. Well, tell you what, you know, this is a Traxxas Slash RC uh, stadium truck, and uh, you know, I don't get out too much and get to play with it too much anymore. So I decided to take it over to the big field over here and really let it rip. You know, I have uh, different types of batteries I use for it. So, you know, I love to fish too, don't get me wrong, but when uh, the fishing uh, is just not there, uh, still gonna have some fun. And I'll tell you, these things out here, whoo, look at that boy go, uh, can be fun. I'm having a great time so far. So let me uh, get into a little more speed, swap out some batteries here in this big old field, see what I can do, all right. Now if I can just keep it on all four wheels. What do we have here? My car spotted Dale out there trying to fish, decided it was just too rough for him, and he is making an exit. Well, I guess my little RC is gonna make an exit as well. I'm having too much fun, I'm gonna keep playing. Just wanted you all to see that, uh, hey, there's other things you can do out here at the park, over here at the Mount Pleasant Pier. I had a blast. So, I'll tell you what, I'll get back into some more fishing. The first two weeks of uh, March uh, is coming up. Uh, hopefully we get into some real monster sheephead and some other good trout. And the weather calms down and warms up, the water temperature comes up. We'll have a blast. Until then, here's one uh, blooper here of my uh, camera inside my RC car. I'll show you that. And for those of you watching for the first time, don't forget, look down, there is a subscribe button. And I'll let you know when I have more shows available. Like I always say, good luck out there, have fun fishing, and hey, have fun with some RCs and other toys too. Later.